Why, hello there. We are doing rear brakes on this 08 Tundra. We already got the piston pushed back. We cracked open the bleeder, put it in our bottle. Hey, there it is. The bleeder. The bleeder screw cap. Still looking for that. I thought I'd lost it. I have found it. So, as you can see, got the slide. Piston pushed all the way back. Brakes are pretty worn out on this. They're not metal on metal, but customer brought it in and said replace. So we said, okay. So here we are. I'm gonna clean off these slides and re-grease them. So I can set that back here on the axle. I should probably put on gloves, but that's okay. That ship has sailed already. Let's get the pads out. One. A two. Get these. Get the off so we can get the axle. So we can get the rotor off. Sorry, this is still really awkward to do, kind of mostly one-handed. Oh, can't wait for my arm to heal. That will be fantastic. Well, it came with a new hardware kit, too. Hopefully, your kit comes with new hardware pieces. Now, we have to get it off. Parking brake's not on. We may have to use the other method. We have to use the screws. Just may have to. Like that. Parking brakes inside the rear end. So there's your parking brake, and uh, then we'll put our new rotors over top, and on we go. All right, so we got our new hardware on, new shiny, new shiny hardware, and uh, we're just gonna get this bolted back up. Pretty easy. You can totally do it in your driveway if you uh, have uh, the tools. Excuse me. I'll do that to make sure none of the uh, hardware is hitting the rotor. Because then you'll get a lovely, lovely squeal. And you'll be like, what the hell is that coming from? So let's... What we're going to end up doing is cleaning, wiping these off. And then we're going to apply some new, some new grease, caliper grease to it. And then getting them in the holes. Making sure it's nice and freshly lubricated. And uh, obviously we got to put the brake pads on. But that's pretty much it, so... I'm gonna let you let you go after that one. But yeah, it's pretty simple. 17 millimeter for both the caliper 
bolts and the caliper bracket bolts. Uh, I guess I'll look up the torque spec and let you know that in just a minute. So thanks. Actually, I'll put that in the comments, in the description.